Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Um, today we're going to be taking on the Alpha Broodmother, second time in a row. Today, hopefully we're going to be a bit luckier than we were last time. And I believe everything I need should be in here. Uh, so I've gone and collected like some more trophies. We can go ahead and do the Alpha Megapithecus again. Um, I've tried getting some stuff for... Um, the dragon. We need to get some more Basilo blubber. And uh, I think that might have been it for now. Let's have a quick look. Ah, oh, actually. So we need Basilo blubber. And we need some Giga Hearts. Which Giga Hearts aren't too bad because you need one for Beta and two for Alpha, but they're just they're hard to find. So <laughs> that will be interesting. Um, because I've only seen the one that I tamed, and other than that, I've never seen another Giga. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Why is there some RGs? Oh no! Let's go ahead, take you, oh no, right, uh, oh, as, as long as there's no Rexes, is there Rexes, doesn't look like there is, we might be okay, uh, where's my RG, let's go, gonna need to go and kill these, um, Oh, there we go, there's another one. Right. Oh no, don't go after my penguins. Oh man, these things are loads of health. Right, there's one of them down. Another one down. There was some more over here. So let's go ahead and take these on. These aren't fully grown yet. Oh, this one is though. Where are you gone? Come back. Come back. Where are you going? There you go. Okay, is the base safe? Are we good? On there? Alright, that's looking fine. See, as I was saying, the only gig we've ever seen is that one, which we tamed. I'm wondering if there's a server limit and it only does one. I don't believe that's the case. Um might have a look online I'm not really using it so if it does only happen to be one I can just unclaim that kill it hopefully I'll get the one heart um, just from unclaiming and killing rather than having to find a completely fresh one and we'll only get we'll only need to find another two to take on the alpha but I'm not too sure if that will work and we'll probably need to find all three. Um, failing that we'll probably just end up spawning in a Giga and then trying to kill that instead. Um, it will cut out the time wait. It will cut out the time needed to go and actually try and find a Giga but then it will also have the challenge of actually trying to kill it as well. Which... I wonder how much of a challenge that will actually be. I'm not too sure, but we'll have to see how that goes. I'm just getting rid of all the eggs in my hatchery. Oh, I don't really want to kill these. I'm trying to stock up on my boss fighting Rexes. So we've completely filled up the... Well, all the obelisks. They're all filled up with one Uteranus, one Deodon, and one... Uh, and 18 Rexes, so we've got all 20 
dinosaurs for each obelisk and then I'm basically just trying to get back up Rexes which I've had going on for a while um, I've got about five backup Rexes now which aren't actually leveled yet they're just fully grown Rexes and I should turn the mating off on those Why does it have to be foggy every time I start recording? Well, not every time, but I'm pretty sure it's been multiple times. When I start recording, it'll end up getting foggy. I've been waiting for it to be daytime to start recording, and now it's daytime and it's all foggy. Just my luck. Let's get those in there. I'll get them growing off camera. Um, let's put that blueprint away. Um, and we're going for the brood mother. So I think all the trophies I need is just these ones. So we'll take those. Um, bullets, yeah, I guess that'll be fine. Uh, I think I've got everything over there that I need to actually go into the arena part of the artifacts so I think that's all I need to bring with me then um, I think that might be yeah I think I might leave it at that I am wearing partially full ghillie because I went to the swamp cave uh, apparently a swamp cave is a decent place to go and get the wreck saddle so I've been trying to run that and get myself a wreck saddle which still hasn't happened yet I've had a couple of red cave beacons I think one of those is where I just got that third blueprint that I've put in here but yeah it's been nothing wonderful um, what was I looking for? I was just looking for my helmet right Oh, and I've just eaten some bad food. Let's just take some healing pots with us. Um, and then, oh yeah, I don't think we'll need anything further. Then let's take our RG and head over to the obelisk. Yeah, so I've not really done anything off camera. Um, it's literally just been breeding my boss fighting rexes and leveling them up so they haven't really been nothing much has really been done off camera since the last episode or it's like the weird thing where a lot's been done off camera but nothing has really changed because all I've been doing is getting those rexes um, not too sure if I'm worried about this obviously we lost it last time to the alpha um, but when we did that, we came very, very close to beating it. We messed up with the Deodon a bit. And... Yeah, I don't. I just don't think we'll have a lot of trouble. Because the... the Megatherium's only had like 30k health as well. Which the T-Rex is almost triple that. It's got 80... 82, I think. 82k. Um, I'm pretty sure it has way more melee damage although I'm kind of curious to see whether that will translate because the Megatheriums they have the added bonus of extra damage against insects plus extra damage once they kill an insect and they have like two buffs that sort of work in their favour against the Broodmother which makes them do extra damage which is why a lot of people favour the Megatheriums in the Broodmother boss um, so I'm not sure oh actually I don't want you in here like I said before I don't think it will oh no I know it won't teleport it to the arena but I don't want it to sort of glitch out and then get rid of it and one of my other RGs I think it's from the last time I left lost the brood lost to the Broodmother is still over here um, which is one of my imprinted ones, but I just kind of left it here and I haven't really done anything with it. And 
just making sure I'm pretty sure I've put meat in everything now yeah so we've been stacking meat when we was leveling up our rexes um, yeah you've got a lot I don't know why you've got berries on you I did notice that before I just didn't really do anything let's go we'll enable the passive healing early I wonder if that actually Okay, so it has used a little bit. I wonder if that's actually healing anything or if it's just... Uh, I don't know what I'm talking about. Let's stop talking and let's get into it. Oh no, I don't have everything. Oh no, I'm missing. <laughs> I'm missing an artifact. Wait. Wow, what's the artifact and immune for? Oh, artifact and immune is in the dragon. I don't know why, I just assumed that would be Broodmother. Wait, so what am I missing? Artifact of the Clever. Damn, okay, well we need to go back and grab that. Right, we're back at the base, and Artifact of the Clever was this one, I believe. Which I only got one of. Which cave is that? Let's go and put the immune one back in there. Alright, I'll see you back at the obelisk. Alright, we're back at the obelisk. I don't know where I'm going. Uh, let's just land there. Um, I was going to say so Oh no, I wasn't really going to say anything. I'm just moaning about the fog again. It's so foggy. <laughs> Why is it always so foggy for me? Let's go. Alpha. Wait, what am I missing now then? Ah, oh, sauropod. I need to kill off some brontos. Uh, let's just make sure that you're in. You're very on the cusp of not being in. There's like a couple of rexes. <laughs> but I think it's like where the feet are. Which I'm pretty sure they're in. I'm hoping they are anyway. Oh no, because I counted it. Well, off camera I counted it and there was 20. Counted as being in. No, 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 no. No, where is my fudging Uteranus? There it is. There you go. And then we go two. Put you there. One. There you go. Oh, there we go. I don't know why they weren't fighting then. But there we go. Right. Okay. Yeah, we're doing good. Um, let's try moving Dead on a bit closer. Just, they are taking a bit of damage. But I don't think they're struggling at all. Ooh. Man, that's got some hit radius on it. There we go. Second time the charm. Okay, so some of them have lost a little bit of health. A really marginal amount of health. You've lost like a quarter. But yeah, not too bad. You still had a lot of food left and obviously a lot of food left in you. I can't really be bothered to do that, but that'll be fine. And... Oh man, I didn't even courage roll, actually, and they still shredded that. But, okay, yeah, there we go. Alpha brood mother down. How much element did I get? 74. Not great, but not terrible. We got our alpha brood mother head. Got another flag. And we are teleporting back. Uh, oh god, where's that going? Okay, that's fine. Whatever. We're good. And that's not the one I want. One I want is back here, I think. Boom. Alright, Alpha Broodmother down. 
all we've got left is to do the dragons, and the dragons are what scare me. Oh, I'm not looking forward to it. Because the thing with the dragons is they have... They don't do just like straight damage, they do a percentage damage. And it's not even... It's not like a percentage of your total health. No, it's not like a percentage of your current health, it's a percentage of your total health. So, it does 20% damage of your total health with its fire breathing attack. So realistically, all it takes is 4 fire breath attacks and then you're gone. <laughs> and it's such a rough boss to try and take on. I'm not entirely sure how I'm going to do it. I think I'm going the wrong way back to my base. I think it's down this river. Is it down this? I don't know where I'm going. Anyway, we'll see you when we get back to the base. Alright, we're back to the base and I just realised that the fog's cleared up and it's actually a nice day in the island arc. Which is wonderful to see. Right, we've got the brood mother head stacked up on the others. So we've now killed all three levels of the Mega Pificus, we've killed all three levels of the Broodmother. Now all we need to take on is the Dragon, which will now be replacing this head. For me, I'm just going straight into the Dragon, and it's going to be just back to back for me. And for you guys, that will be next episode. Um, so if you did enjoy this one, don't forget to drop a like, and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Um, next episode is just going to be straight up Alpha Dragon. And then episode after that we're going to go Mosasaur hunting and we're going to try and get ourselves a new Moser. A new Moser, we're going to get ourselves an Al uh, and a Moser. A Mo Yeah, a Moser. We're going to get ourselves a Moser, our first one, which will help us do that water cave that gets us one of the dragon artifacts because I'm not doing that without a Moser because that was freaking ridiculous. Um, while we're out there we'll try searching for some more Basilo Blubber. And if we come across any alphas, that'll be cool, and we'll take those on as well. And until next time, see you later.